The utility of the future, we believe, will look very different than the utility of today and certainly even of the utility even five or ten years ago. I think now that uh, AMI networks are in place and actually reaching maturity, uh, we're finding that utilities are wanting to uh, do more with the data than just uh, billing and, and kind of the classic uses of AMI. So now there's, there's a whole bunch of new paradigms that are causing the utilities to have to rethink how do we do business because our customer base is changing. Our customer base wants more timely information. Electric vehicles. All of a sudden now, everybody on your street goes out and buys an electric vehicle. What's going to happen to that substation if everybody turns on uh, their charging all at once? The typical model that's been in existence for almost a century with the electric utility industry has been vertical. Centralized generation, over, delivered over a transmission system, down to distribution grid networks. The utility of the future may look nothing like that. In fact, it could be a more holistic grid that has both distributed energy resources, serving customers, all operating over the same grid. We built a system that was not just an AMI platform, but a platform that would support what we call grid management solutions. So that definition is sort of a comprehensive set of applications that allows a utility to create intelligent distribution networks. So that includes demand response, it includes voltage management, uh, VAR management, different applications to help them create more efficient use of their feeders and, and manage their capacity better. One of the applications where uh, the, the utilities are interested is as it relates to load management. Uh, load management gives them an opportunity to engage their consumers, provide benefit to their consumers, while at the same time uh, develop a resource that offsets real costs on behalf of the utility. Uh, as an example, the, the fuel costs associated with operating a, a plant, the capital uh, expenditure associated with building a new plant for peak capacity that happens you know, 100, to 100 hours a year. One of the key assets that Landis and Gear has in its uh, platform portfolio is the, uh, the Gridstream MDMS. What we're seeing now is uh, that uh, that technology is actually transforming to a point where it's becoming a, uh, the foundation, the key foundational element for advanced applications. Uh, we're already delivering some of those advanced applications today. We have uh, outage management today with uh, the Gridstream MDMS. Uh, we're also looking at things like transformer load management, uh, revenue protection, and a whole family of other kinds of applications built on that technology. Our AMI meters collect a tremendous amount of data beyond what's needed for the billing process that brings a lot of value around grid analytics. Now you match that with additional sensing that can occur at the primary level, primary voltage level of a utilities grid. You put those two together, now you can do some extremely valuable grid analytics that those separate you couldn't gain as much value out of. The applications that are asking for data uh, are looking for analytics in two different ways. We talk about data at rest, which is traditional analytics, you know, next day type analytics, what are you looking for in trends, but the smart grid of the future is looking for things to happen dynamically, so that's what we call data in motion. So now you're making decisions and you're getting insights and having to action on them in real time. To do that, you have to have a scale platform that can react, uh, that you measure this in seconds, not hours. We built Gridstream to be a, a platform for uh, both sensors to provide data to the utilities and also uh, actuators to, to take action in response to utilities and customers' needs. Uh, the foundation is already there with the AMI systems that have, uh, the utilities have already bought. Uh, the, uh, the power of the sensor network is that it can actually provide uh, data feeds uh, that can be combined with other data feeds from other parts of the utility's business to, to drive applications the utility has not even thought of today. So we'll continue to look to add solutions to the portfolio to help utilities manage their distribution feeders better. You know, in the past, we helped them manage their business operations better. The future is really focusing on grid management solutions to help them manage the grid better.